Hello everyone, and welcome to my Days of Our Lives official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Jack Returns, Eli and Lonnie's Visit, Prom Night, Justin's Discovery. Days of Our Lives are then. Suckers can anticipate Jack Devereaux to make a surprise return. Eli Grant and Lonnie Price, Grant, come for a special visit. Plus, Teresa Donovan keeps an eye on Tate Black on Hop Night. Also, Steve Johnson makes a concession to Justin Kiriakis. Keep reading to find out what's coming up in the Peacock Cleaner pieces. Days of Our Lives Jack Devereaux returns DOL spoilers for the week of June 17th reveal that Jack makes a surprise return to Salem. It comes right after Clyde Weston told Chad DeMera that Abigail DeMera is still alive. Chad will tell Julie Williams about Clyde's claim. Julie asks Chad if he believes it, and he's not sure. On the one hand, Chad knows that Clyde will say anything to delay going back to captivity. On the other hand, Chad knows firsthand that people do tend to come back from the dead in Salem. So, Chad and Julie might fill in Jack on the news. Of course, Chad and Julie might also keep it to themselves. Chad might not want to unnecessarily upset Jack if it turns out that Clyde is just blowing hot air. D.O.L. Alani come back Jack is and the only returning character during the week of June 17th. Suckers will also see Eli and Lonnie make a special visit to Salem. Hopefully, they will have the halves with them this time. Eli and Lonnie will come to Salem to help Abe Carver and Paulina Price celebrate their marriage anniversary. As suckers know, Abe and Paulina's anniversary coincides with the Juneteenth vacation. Days of Our Lives Salem's teen scene prom night 2024 Days of Our Lives reveal that it'll be hop night. Teresa and Brady Black will keep an eye on Holly Jonas and Tate during the event. Still, we've a feeling that Tate and Holly might sneak off to get some alone time together. DOL, during the week Stefan DiMera confronts EJ DiMera. Maggie Horton Kiriakis learns shocking news about Constantine Meliunis. Steve confesses to Justin. Marlena Evans questions Eric Brady's passions for Nicole Walker DiMera. Plus, Alex Kiriakis explains to Brady. Meanwhile, EJ and Johnny DiMera get some special father-slash-son cling time. Johnny will also be preparing to go after his coming career thing. Eli and Lonnie return to Salem, Days of Our Lives, note that suckers should gear up for a fun super couple return. According to Soap Opera Digest, Lonnie Price, Grant, and Eli Grant will make a comeback on the cleaner during the week. As per SOD, the happy couple is returning to help Paulina Price and Abe Carver celebrate their anniversary. But will they get locked into some other drama, too? Days of Our Lives Alani gets into the thick of effects, DOL spoilers have ent indicated important about Alani's visit. The last time they were seen on oil was before this time when Paulina was battling cancer, as well as a heart condition Days of Our Lives spoilers Eli and Lonnie return to Salem the week of June 17th, 21 the halves may come on for the lift, which probably means Paulina and Abe will also get to see Carver Grant as well as Jules Grant. Either way, with the conflict going on between Chanel Dupree and Paulina, Alani could find themselves knee-deep in the drama. Still, could Lani help smooth effects over between her family and her mama? DOL, how long will they stay? Day spoilers do end offer important information around how long the couple plans to stay this time around, still, it may only be for some days perhaps weeks. Saad is also reporting that the CW mega-hit, All American, has been renewed. Of course, Lamont Archie plays star Carter on the show, so his filming schedule could be filling up. Still, while they might not be in Salem for long, Alani will formerly again be seen in the Little City as 2024 progresses. In addition to celebrating Paulina and Abe's anniversary this month, they were also seen in the 15.000 occasion festivity print posted on DOL social media, which means suckers can also look forward to seeing the super couple in November. Too when that show airs. Kiriaki's puzzle, Stephanie's discovery, Marlena's stunner days of our lives, are then. Suckers can anticipate Alex Kiriaki's Brady Black and Xander Cook to meditate over Constantine Meliuni's warning. 
Coming up on Days of Our Lives, meanwhile, Marlena Evans shares bad news about Everett Lynch aka Robert Bobby Stein to Stephanie Johnson. Keep reading and let's talk about what's coming up in the Peacock Cleaner pieces. Kiriaki's family puzzle DOL spoilers for Tuesday, June 11, reveal that there will be a new mystification for the Kiriaki's family to break. Indeed though con man was eventually taken down, he dropped one final cryptic communication. Constantine told Alex, Xander, and Brady that the Kiriaki's family still has an adversary in their midst. Of course, Connie was talking about Teresa Donovan. Trending DOL Spoilers Weekly Update Marriage Pellets, Marlena's Bad News, Leo's Remedy, Chanel's Discovery Now, Connie Did End Expose Teresa as His Maid in Crime. The family has formerly wondered who could have been helping Constantine. Nothing suspects Teresa, but all secrets come out ultimately. Steve Johnson's fate over at the Kiriakis manse, Sarah Horton will try to tend to a shot Steve Johnson. Still, it appears that John Black might be transubstantiating into the pawn. That clearly is odd, since Constantine has been excluded and John is ent looking at the red card. Indeed, Steve noticed that look in John's eyes as if he is ent himself right now. Marlena Evans' stunner days of our lives reveal that Marlena will have to deliver unfortunate news to Stephanie. This news will be about Everett. Everyone has been trying to get Everett into treatment for dissociative identity complaint. Still, Bobby might have too important control. While Everett wants the help, his menacing alter Bobby does not. Trending Days of our lives Ava and Lucas surprising new couple Unite after Harris exits DOL suckers might also see what happens after Alex, Brady, and Xander report that they excluded Constantine. There's also Xander being the shooter. While Xander might be justified and was trying to stop a dangerous con man, pulling the detector could beget some issues for Xander. Xander is a reformed villain and has worked really hard to be a better man. Xander has eventually won Sarah and is a father to their son, Victoria Horton, Cook. Still, could shooting Constantine make Xander question his redemption? Just dropped a big hint that it may be ramping up for a troublemaker's return still, however, Leo's problems may soon be getting much worse, if their first meeting is any suggestion. Because he opened up a bit about how delicate life has been with a mama like Diana Colville, which got a whole surge of sympathy from Marlena. She responded that Diana was a veritably perturbed woman, which is commodity she of all people should know firsthand. Also again, when Diana first popped up back in the 1987, firstly played by General Hospital's Jeannie Francis, to love John, back when we all allowed. He was Roman, she really was not all that bad. Also, Marlena was allowed. Dead at the time, so it's not like she stole John down. The two had a tumultuous relationship, complicated by Diana's war with Victor. She'd de come to City to swipe a mysterious computer fragment, it was the 80s, from Victor. But it was ent long before she came into huge totalities of plutocrat when her father failed and left her the Colville fortune which her mama and Victor plotted to get their hands on. She and John were on and off as she alternately turned to him for protection from Victor and was pushed down as she ticked him off with her vengeance schemes. Eventually, they fell piecemeal for good when her partner Cal showed up to beget trouble. That crowned in Diana shooting John while trying to hit Cal as they fought each other. He lapsed into a coma, and, affrighted, Diana packed up and left City without a word until Leo showed up twenty times latterly. Diana, played in 2019 by the young and the restless Judith Chapman, followed her son to City and revealed that she still carried a arsonist for John. Over the times, however, she had grown a bit more crooked, first lying to John that Leo was his son, also trying to get him down from Marlena by poisoning the croaker. She's been in captivity ever ago, and it's come clear over the times that Leo's life with her was anything but idyllic. And now that Leo's set to begin remedy and, presumably, talk about his meddled-up mama a whole lot more, we re-wondering if this could be a prelude to her return. Five times is a long time for a cleaner character to stay in captivity. Diana could be just about over for parole, allowing her to return to city and inflict annihilation on Salem formerly again. John and Marlena are formerly vulnerable right now with all this pawn stuff, so if ever there was a time for her to return to make effects indeed worse for them, it's now. What are your studies? 
Are we going to be seeing Diana in City again soon?